In this quick tutorial, I'll show you how we can make this bounce effect in your Elementor website. So you can see, this image is bouncing to the edges of this section and also it's rotating itself with this beautiful animation. So without further ado, let's see how we can make this fun effect. So for creating this effect, we don't need Elementor Pro or any other extra plugin. All we are going to build by using only the free version of Elementor. Okay, so basically you can create this effect inside any section or any containers. But here I will create our this effect inside this container. So let's drag an image widget inside that. And let's drag it to the very first of this content and upload an image. You can upload any image you want. But here for this effect, I recommend you to use a round image like this wood ball. Let's insert this. And here let's also adjust its width, 200 pixel. And initially I want to place this at this top left corner here. So from this advanced option, I want to make its position to the absolute. And now finally to achieve this effect, first of all we need to add a class with that. MDW bouncing image. And then we also need to write some custom code. So let's add an HTML widget and drag it to here. And inside that, let's paste this code snippet. And you also don't need to worry about this code snippet. I'll give all the code to my website and also give that code snippet link to my description. So from here, you can just copy and paste this code. Okay, and you can see this effect is already activated but it's bouncing at the middle of our this section. So to fix this, let's go to this image settings and let's make it alignment to the left side. And I also want to place this image behind our this content. So let's again go to the advanced option and make it the index to the zero. Now if we save this and from our preview, now we can see this amazing bouncing effect, okay? But here, if we also scroll down, we can see some white spaces down to this section. So we can see this space because here you can see this moving image is going outside of our this parent container. So to prevent this, let's go to this container settings and we need to make its overflow to the hidden. Okay, now that problem has been solved. Now here, if we look at our this custom code snippet, here we can also find some cool options like you can control the speed of this moving ball for the desktop, tablet and mobile devices. So here if you make it to 500, we can see that looks crazy. Okay. And then here is also this rotating speed option. So we can make this much faster or even if you don't want this rotation at all, you can also make it completely zero. Okay. But I want to keep it to the default 50. Then here, if you look at this image, you can see a slight shadow with that. So we have give this drop shadow by using this CSS line here. Then here, if you also want to check this for our other devices, like the tablet, you can see it's also looking great. And here, I think we need to reduce the size of this image. Let's make it to 100 pixel. And lastly, for mobile, it also looks great. So that's how we can create this bouncing image effect in your Elementor website. So if you enjoyed this tutorial, then don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on my next video.